Hi everyone! I'm back with another unboxing. This time, um, this is an Amazon Dash wand with Alexa. So I picked this up a couple of weeks ago and I haven't had a chance to open it. Um, but I'm ready now and I want to share it with you guys. So. so here it is. The, I just I guess they just call it the Amazon wand. Uh, on the product description is Amazon Dash wand with Alexa. Uh, should be the same. So let's open this up. I picked this up for twenty dollars on Amazon, and for a limited time, they do give you a twenty dollar credit back onto your account after you activate this and link it to a, an Amazon Prime account. So this is essentially free. So I'm pretty excited to get started with this. Let's see what we can do with it. So, um, so basically, what this thing is supposed to do is you can ask it questions like how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon, how many calories are there in a Greek yogurt, uh, things like that, and it's it has a speaker for it to respond back to you, but and it also has a um, a scanner for you to scan things. So let me find a way to open this. Here we go. Ta da! Nice black box. Oh, it comes with batteries too. I have batteries prepared on the side, but it takes two AAA batteries. This is what it looks like. This is like a magnetic hook. You can go in the fridge. And two batteries and a quick start guide. So let's just get started. So I didn't even touch the metal, it looks like there's fingerprints on it. You see that? Maybe it's the tape smudging it, I don't know. There's the scanner, pretty neat. If you ever dreamed of uh, working in a supermarket as a scanner, well there you go. So quick start guide. So there's the say scan button, there's a little speaker and microphone. That's the speaker. That's the microphone. So just give it a hard pull. And it comes right apart. Just illustrations to show you how the batteries go in, but they go in the same same way. There's that. And now I'm gonna go to Amazon.com wand setup. So I have my iPad on the side here, so give me a moment. Oh, here we go. There's a scanner. Orange, good. I'm gonna hit connect on my app. Oh, and the app died, basically. So let me go back here. Open in my app. I need to update my app. Oh, okay. Let me update my Amazon app first. It crashed. So let me update the Amazon app. All right, the update is done. <clears throat> All right, let's do this again. One setup, open in Amazon, get started, continue, connect, okay. Okay, the app keeps dying every time I hit the connect button. What the hell? See if I can show you this. Open in my app. This is stupid. US dash one, open, get started, continue. It's orange, connect, and it dies. So that's kind of pointless. I'll have to use my iPhone. So I'll stop recording and I'll be back after I set this up. 
All right, I'm back. I've set up the um, Amazon Dash Wand with Alexa. So I could not set this up on my iPad Pro. I'm not sure why, even though I, even after I updated the um, Amazon app, it still didn't work. I had to use my iPhone and it worked uh, instantly. Basically, you put in the batteries um, and then you hold this button until it turns orange. And then you just go to like amazon.com slash one setup and follow the instructions there. It's basically just hitting next, 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 and then putting in your Wi-Fi password and that's it. So here it is, all set up, and you can talk. You can um, talk to it by pressing this button. So, how many tablespoons are in a stick of butter? One stick equals eight tablespoons. How many calories are in an apple? There are fifty-three calories in an apple. Ask all recipes for a recipe with chicken. The skill. All recipes can help you with that. Did you want to enable it? No. All right. All right. So it's basically like it's basically Alexa, but without having to say Alexa, because you hold the button down when you want to interact with it. Um, so I want to check out the scanner. So I have a Campbell's cream of chicken soup here. And what happens if I scan this? What if I scan this guy? Which one? Let me try this. Let me scan this picker upper thing. Um, what's the weather today? Bristol, it's 85 degrees with partly sunny skies. You can expect more of the same today, with a high of 85 degrees and a low of 59 degrees. So it's just like uh, Alexa, but I'm actually not in Bristol. Maybe it's a setting, I'm not sure. Um, but that was a little disappointing. It didn't, it, I mean, it doesn't know where I'm at. Um, let me see. Add dishwasher detergent to my cart. Dishwasher detergent to your cart. So I have no idea what it added to my cart. Um, and I'm refreshing it on my iPad and the Amazon app, and I don't see anything yet. So, oh. Uh, yeah, I'm refreshing my app, and I don't see anything. Oh, well. Well, like I said, this thing was like essentially free. So if anything, it's a good kitchen device where you can just hang and just quickly ask it things. I don't think it can, it can do things like set timers though. Set timer for five seconds. Timers are not currently supported on this device. And you can, you can tell that she has a stutter problem. Set timer for 10 minutes. Timers are not currently supported on this device. How many sticks of butter should I put in my chicken pot pie? The skill. All recipes can help you with that. Did you want to enable it? No. All right. So there's a big push for all recipes. There's probably some partnership they had. But there you go. The Amazon wand. Comes with batteries, $20. And as soon as you register this device like I just did, I'm expecting to see a $20 credit in my account. So this is essentially free. I'm sure it's uh, one per account. Uh, the only caveat to that $20 is it has to be something sold by Amazon um, with prime shipping, I think. So you might want to read up on that. And it is a, um, uh, you know, a deal that's going on right now. I don't know how long it's going to last, but uh, if you haven't picked up one of these yet, uh, I would actually recommend it because it's free. Um, otherwise, I don't know if I'd pay $20 for this because I already have an, uh, um, an Echo Dot in my kitchen. So I'm not sure if I would just pay for this otherwise. So let me see, positives and negatives. So positives, it's a nice package, easy to hold, rubber handle here in case your hands are greasy. Easy enough to push the button. You don't have to say Alexa and worry about it not um, 
uh, listening. It comes with a hook. I'm assuming this is magnetic. Um, I don't have anything to test it on right now. It might be double-sided tape for all I know. So the pluses, the size, the convenience, um, the negatives, it doesn't do timers. It, it does stutter sometimes, but then so do humans, so I, I can't really blame her for that. Um, you can add things to your cart, but I have no idea what's in the cart. I asked for detergent earlier. I don't know what's in my cart. I don't even see it in my app. I don't know what she added. I don't know how much it cost. Um, but I probably just need to spend some more time with this. So let me use it a little bit longer. And if I have anything else to share that's significant, I'll make another video. But this is just a quick unboxing of the Amazon wand. Again, it's $20 on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description. And for a limited time, it's giving you $20 back in credit. So it's kind of free. Um, get it while it's free. Otherwise, I, I like I said, I don't think I would buy this for $20. I'd spend a little bit more and get a Echo Dot or something that can play my music. Because uh, as far as I know, this cannot control Spotify or play music. Alrighty. Alright, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, please post it um, below and I'll be sure to get back to you. Alright, bye. So it turns out I think this uh, scanner does work. So when you scan something that doesn't work, it makes that sound. But when it works, you hear the ding, affirmative ding. There it is. And uh, if you look in your cart, um, so yesterday it doesn't show like one item, two item, three item, but when you go into it, it does show stuff that you scan on this device. So it does seem to work.